Hi, very good afternoon to everyone. Yeah, welcome back to our this uh, lunch talk from Rest and Relax. Yeah, so today, yeah, how is everyone uh, this week? Uh, actually quite excited, right? Uh, heard, not excited lah. Heard like uh, we're going to like delay the, the, the what? Can go outside and eat one uh, because of some new cluster. I am bopian now. Uh, safety, safety more important now. Okay, so uh, welcome to our this uh, FB live today. So again, today uh, we're going to share something interesting. All right, nothing about design, nothing about renovation, but it's a very important thing that you must have in your house. Okay, so uh, let's wait uh, for more people to come in. All right. So later on, can just uh ask anything you want about this uh, topic. All right, so this topic is what? Eh? Later then I'll share with you what are the topic we're going to share today. And today we have a very special guest to join us on this topic because uh, I'm not the professional on this ground. Eh? Okay, ID, I know, la, Chong Siu, I know, la, but you talk about this, uh, this, this, this thing, right? I think it's not easy. All right. Hello, hello. Hi, hi, Cynthia. Hello, hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can help me to share or not? Share. All right, help me to share out. Okay, if today uh, 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 you're staying in the house, right, and always got this very um, irritating problem. Okay, later I ask. Hello, hi, hi. Can help me to share, share out? Hello, hi, hi. This might be a very, like, uh, a very, like, crucial problem no yeah always my kids are uh, uh, hi Margaret always my kids got this problem uh, my handphone surely rang one okay sometimes can be many days uh, my kids never message me hi Levine or or they never think of me one uh. but this thing happen uh, they still sure think for papa or mama right now agree normally kids uh, remember us uh, maybe they want to buy something online they need your cash or or they need some cash or, or some favor, lah, huh? <laughs> then they will remember you. <laughs> okay, well, all right. Yeah. So I think uh, it's, uh, this one also, this one is super important. I can guarantee chop uh, 100% when this thing happened, right? Your handphone will share rank. Uh, this one also, this one is super important. Okay, so if let's say you want your kids to remember you, right? You just always do this thing, right? They will call you. <laughs> Okay, so we have 22 fans now. Thanks for these 22 fans. Can you help me to share out our this uh, live so we can have more people to, to understand this, uh, this problem in the house. Okay, I, I, although I'm doing ID, right? But when I face this problem, uh, my head also crack. Yeah, head crack. Wow, very headache. Because there are so many type of uh, function that you can be used. Yeah, that's why... Uh, is a lot of function can be used long. So yeah, so it's not easy. All right. So this is a good uh it's a good good sharing today. Lah. Oh. So please help me to share up to more more friends that they can also enjoy this uh, free knowledge because I'm very difficult to book for this professional to come and share you know about this thing. All right. So what you're gonna to share today leh, is about Wi-Fi. Okay, so dear, dear fans, right? Wi-Fi important. No? If you think Wi-Fi important, please type a yes. Yes, please type a yes. Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi. Do you think Wi-Fi is important in the house? Important? My 19 fans can help me to share out. <laughs> okay, this is very uh, important topic. Okay, 20 years ago. Uh, hi, Janet. 20 years ago, right? Maybe you think uh, no gas, no reticle, very important, right? <laughs> now, uh, hi, hi, hi. Now it's no Wi-Fi. Uh, wow, super important. I don't know. Uh, sometimes when the Wi-Fi down, right, I, I also blur. I don't know who to call. So sometimes a bit, a bit like uh, frustrated, you know. Hi, Yaling. Because you call the Wi-Fi station or Wi-Fi the te techo people, right? <laughs> They'll ask you a lot of questions. Uh, what do you see now? Hi, Catherine. What is the color? What is the light? What is the bonnet name? What is the this one? What is the that one? Wow, I hate it. Ah. 
I'm not very good on this type of like uh, online thing one. I'm very scared one. Eh. I don't know why. I don't know whether you've got fans like me or not. Uh, very scared about Wi-Fi thing one. Like the Wi-Fi, something happened, right? Like no, like blur, I like, don't know who to call. Then you call the, the, the help center, right? Then they'll ask you a lot of questions. Of this, of that, plug out, plug in. Uh, then end of the day, right? Still, uh, you cannot see. No? Because recently I just done up my house also. Although I'm an ID, right? But I'm not really good on this type of uh, uh, online thing. So I don't know that I don't know that if your house put CCTV, uh, you got a very uh, simple way to do it. You can buy from online, then you plug on your house CCTV. Then after that, uh, there's one tab is you must buy a, 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 a one box uh, and then you have to, you know, uh, like the, the box can help you to record down something like that. So I, I, then I know that was CCTV also a lot of choice, like, a lot of thing, a lot of choice to do and not easy also, wow, headache. So since I mentioned, right, hey, help me to share, help me to share, not 34 ready, like, wow, very good, very good. Okay, like, today we do some lucky draw, like, cannot. Uh, Jenny, Jenny, can you help me to post on the, the admin site, right? Help share and out, right? We have three lucky draw. All right, three lucky draw. We give this uh, voucher, voucher. Other NTUC, Capital Land or anything. Lah. All right, $20 voucher. Okay? Help me to share. Lah. Tap to your friend. Lah. Okay? So Jenny, can you help me to write and put inside? Share out a bit. So like I mentioned, right? So my kids will always call me huh, when uh when Wi-Fi down. Wow, very kanchong eh. Papa, papa, hey, help me uh, the Wi-Fi down leh. Uh, uh, when uh, when uh. Wow, they very kanchong leh. Wow, must faster one eh. Hey, when can finish uh, papa? When the Wi-Fi can finish uh? Then my, my son play game uh, was halfway uh, down uh. Wow, jalat. Wow, call. Wow, papa, help me, help me. Wow. So I always think that I'm kind of like appreciate la, when the Wi-Fi down. <laughs> Wi-Fi down, la, wow, I like, I like very, uh, yeah, I would say use 4G. La, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't know what G, la, 4G, 5G, 6G, what wire mess, don't know what mess. Ah, I very headache. What, what cable, land, this sort of thing. Okay, so today we're going to talk, talk east, talk west, talk everything. Today, don't talk about renovation, okay? We talk about professional things like this uh, Wi-Fi stuff. Okay, so I get a very professional friend. Then he can actually help everyone uh, to understand more about the Wi-Fi, how to be stable. Because I think nowadays, a lot of people work at home, right? Ma? So I think the house uh, stableness is very important. Okay? So, uh, yeah. So sometimes the Wi-Fi down, normally what we do, we'll call... Or the telco center, ask them what happened. Then very kind of my always Wi-Fi down. We want it to settle fast, right? Must must run down and fry down and help you to do. Yeah, so sometimes also quite um, like quite troublesome like, because you're working, my working, then your kids call you, right? Then keep on call you and say, when, 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 finish, when can come down, papa, when, when, wow. Without Wi-Fi, like the whole world, jala there. Oh. So I always talk a joke, right? Nowadays, the kids, right, can don't eat, can don't eat breakfast, can don't eat lunch, can don't eat dinner, but cannot don't eat Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi uh, can make them full, one, eh? you know. No? <laughs> if your Wi-Fi have, uh, they, they don't need to eat one. They can just play Wi-Fi from day to night. Oh. All right. So Wi-Fi is more, more better than those like uh, chicken or fish. Uh. <laughs> like, you never, like you never buy food, right? Your kid won't tell you, Papa, today no food to eat. La. Hungry they won't. Eh? Maybe they just eat baggy me or they eat this uh, kanaki or, or bad honor. But no Wi-Fi. Ah. Wow, straight they will call you. <laughs> okay, so some example. La. Nowadays, you know kids, right? Like to stay in the room. La. Okay, last time, how, how I, I, I share with everyone. I got five kids. Ma, oh, one boy, four girl. When my kid below like uh, 12 years old, hi, Jessica, or below, I think that time below below 15 years old. Last time I stay in the townhouse. You know what I do? No? I'm very smart. Huh? My second story, third story, huh? no Wi-Fi one, except my room. Okay? I put the most powerful Wi-Fi in downstairs, first story. So no matter how, right? Hey, JJ, no matter how, right? Uh, they have to come down and 
use the Wi-Fi. Okay, so I got five kids, right? Sijian Tao, right? They will rush down downstairs, then they will sit together and play Wi-Fi one. Okay, so I just some suggestion now. Uh, if you think that you want to control your kid lah, below 12 years old or below 15, yeah, you can put the stronger Wi-Fi uh, downstairs your living area. So they no choice there. They have to come down to the first story. Okay? Uh, so I think that's a good idea. Lah. But now different. Lah. Now my kids all tua han liao ma. Now my eldest is 21. My second is 17, 16. So I never do that. Lah. But uh, for those school one, right? My four kids, uh, three kids still school one, right? I will still keep their handphone in the next time. Maybe the worst, the worst, like uh, 3 one lah, is 11 o'clock. Uh, 10 o'clock, they have to pass their handphone to us. Yeah, so I want them to sleep uh, in the night time. I think this method not bad. Like, oh, you, can, you can talk to your kids. Lah, say that, okay, night time is for you to sleep. So, yeah, uh, you know, we don't say confiscate. We say we help you to keep and charge battery. Okay, I think that this idea is good. So 10 o'clock, they automatically bring their handphone to your room. Yeah, then you will keep. Bro. You see, so I think that is a good uh, idea. Lah. I'll just share with you. Okay. All right, very good. We have 36 uh, fans now. Please help me to share. See, you can reach 50 or you know, reach 50. Uh, help me to share, share. Thank you. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Howard. Adrian. Hi, Kenneth. Hi, hi, hi. You can ask anything. You can ask anything online later about this Wi-Fi thing. Especially nowadays, they have this 5G coming, right? So what type of uh, software or hardware can support this 5G? You also can ask. All right. So if you ask me, right, the most scary one in the house uh, is not, I never pay the bill, it's the Wi-Fi down. <laughs> Thank you, Doris. Thank you. You know, the Wi-Fi down, I, I did. Call here, call there. Uh, wow, very hard. Because really, Hi-Fi is so important. No? Without Hi-Fi, YouTube, la, uh, uh, all the movie, all cannot see. Le. Wow. Very the thumb. Sometimes in outside, your, your bar is okay. But you go inside the room, uh, become weak. Uh, then we start to and buy some, uh, you know, you go to those electronic shop and start to buy something to plug here, plug there, you know. Hello, hello, Benjamin. Hi, hi, hi. You know, start to plug here, plug there. Don't know what to buy also. Like, just listen. Uh, this one can plug here, can plug there. Oh. Okay. So today, our topic will be sharing about Wi-Fi, how to have a stable Wi-Fi in your house, what to use, and use the right product. Yeah, but only can two seconds onward. Yeah, not difficult. Yeah, correct. Sometimes it just disappeared like that. Okay, so uh, nowadays we work at home uh, and the usage is very, very heavy. A lot of people use the Wi-Fi because everyone's staying at home. Okay, so I think it's also good that uh, can, uh, you know, have, can share. Uh, all right. Okay, so we have 34 fans now. Thank you very much. We still uh, 34, <coughs> my fans here. Uh. Thank you so much. All right, so today I'm going to recommend my very good friend. His name is called Bruce. Uh, Bruce won't be in, in this uh, uh, market for a long time. All right? He's actually doing those like uh, high-tech technology thing. Okay, so it's a very good uh, experience. Uh, that's why I invite him to come in to actually share with everyone. All right, so you're going to share what is the five common problems we face in the house. Five common problems we face on the house. Hello, hi, hi, Carrie, hi. Okay, stand a chance to win 20 Capital Land voucher. Like, share, comment. Thank you so much. Okay, see, so you can have 50 people. Now. All right, so you're going to share five common problems that always, uh, you know, hi, hi, Kun Kun. Uh, five, five common problems that always, you know, Wi Fi down in the home, in the house. And what should we do? What is the first step should we do? Should we upgrade? Should we call? Or should we retrain everything, you know? Yeah, I thank you, Jessica. Okay, like and share. Thank you. Okay, love. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So I think uh, this is important also. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. So now, more great just done the three room. Oh, 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 thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Doris. Okay. So now, let's welcome our guest of uh, this is a special guest of AOE Art of Entertainment. The name is called Bruce. Please give a six, can a six. Type six means that you welcome him. La. Can you type six? Hey, brother, please don't go out. Type six, then you can go out. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, type six, six. Oh. Put six, la. welcome, la. welcome. <laughs> then I, I ask him to come in. La. Never know. No people type six. La. Ayo. Huh? No people type six. 
啊，那 people 的要看 my friend 啊。<laughs> okay, okay. Thank you, Muhammad. At least you got one six, ah. Oh, okay, I think got so many six. Okay, 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 okay. Enough. Three people comment six. You can come already. Okay, Avis. Thank you. Okay, welcome, Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Hi, hello. Hi. Hello, hi. hello, Wilson. Yeah, hello. Bruce is my good friend, lah. So, uh, also my mentors helping my ID work to do all those like uh online high tech technology stuff. Okay, Bruce. Maybe can recommend a bit about yourself. Okay, hi. Ah, uh, oh, how? Well, ah, my name is Bruce, and my surname happens to be Lee, lah. So I think it's ah uh, not too. Bruce Lee, ah. Wow, shit. So tell me, ah, you call Bruce Lee, ah. Oh. Yeah. So. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. It's not too difficult to ah uh, remember my name, lah. <laughs> so, um, ah, uh, I represent AOE. So our company deals with ah uh, audio, visual, automation, and ah uh, networking. So ah, uh, if you need anything, any advice, you can always ah uh, check out with us, ah. Uh. Mm. Yeah. So, um, so can I check with you, uh, Bruce? What is the common problem that we always face in the house uh, for Wi-Fi stuff? What What is the thing? Because Wi-Fi run very fast, eh? Like、mm. buy certain thing, 还没有用哦，就 chain, 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 and chain so fast. 对对对 So what is、oh. the common problem always we actually see in the house? Yeah. Can you see my screen right now? Ah、uh, yes, yes. So um, the, the、so、there are some common problems that clients okay, usually example, call、yeah. us and ask us. Ah,、uh. uh, one ah,、uh, they said. Toilet no Wi-Fi. Toilet no Wi-Fi. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, to my fans, right? Always you go toilet go no toilet. Wi-Fi. Please key a six. Uh, key a six six. <laughs> If you go toilet no Wi-Fi, got this problem. Yeah. 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 So, um, I mean, toilet no Wi-Fi probably also means that um certain area of the house lah, the Wi-Fi is uh is uh not strong enough or there is uh a. a Blind spot over there that doesn't have any. So,、uh, so、Wi-Fi. I ask your Bruce. Ah,、uh, sometimes the、mm. Wi-Fi. Ah,、uh, because there's a wall in the room. Is it? I I heard something、mm. that ah、uh, people say the Wi-Fi cannot go through the wall. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Something like that cannot block. I thought Wi-Fi is like wireless can go anywhere. Yes. Ah,、uh, Wi-Fi is ah、uh, wireless. But how? Whenever the specification, if there is any ah、uh, that stated on the box when you purchase a Wi-Fi, ah、uh, mm. a wireless access point, ah we call it. Mm. So um. There is always they say maybe ah、uh, five to ten meters or ten to fifteen meters. Oh, must、so、check on the wall. Must check yeah, on the wall. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Ah,、uh, I mean, ah,、uh, not say must check lah, but in in a nutshell, take it as a pinch of salt because most of the time ah、uh, ah is your home it will not be a very ideal situation. Meaning、oh. to say that there is always wall. Some some houses has partition wall. Some have concrete、mm. wall. Some have concrete wall. Then after that, wall ah、uh, wardrobe and、mm. so on and so forth. So all these. Are things that ah、uh, will affect the coverage of the Wi-Fi, um.、Mm-hmm. So there are certain practices that we 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 have, and a certain type of ah、uh, wireless access point that we have that、mm-hmm. maximize ah、uh, the coverage. Oh. Yeah.、Okay. So um maybe I can ah、uh, with this I I maybe I can share with a little bit of ah、okay. uh, since we talk about top five common、yeah. problems, right? Yes. So these are the. Usually, when clients come to our showroom, ah,、uh, they will ask us questions like, "Hey, I in my home, ah,、uh, the toilet no Wi-Fi or oh, okay." So they are actually talking about the coverage of the place, not very good.、Mm. So when when coverage of the place not very good, certain because usually when you buy ah、uh, or or you subscribe to a internet service provider, they will give you a free ah、uh, two in one or three in one kind of ah、uh, ah、uh, uh, system. It's a、oh. router, modem, and ah、uh, wireless. Access point all into one,、mm. so ah、uh, nothing wrong with that. But the thing is, as our requirement now over the years ah、uh, in- increases, as our type of ah、uh, or number of ah、uh, wireless devices ah、uh, increases ah,、mm. uh, this type of so called free device or three in one device ah、uh, becomes、mm. insufficient ready, ah、mm. uh, and and especially currently a lot of people have their latest five G phone with a very capable. Ah,、uh, network card inbuilt to their laptop or their ah、uh, smart devices. Ah,、uh, they can actually accept a much faster connection.、Mm. So ah,、uh, in order to match that faster connection, ah,、uh, our internet uh, must ah、uh, also match. So a lot of people think, ah,、uh, I just subscribe to ah one G one Gbps、uh, or or two G lah, two Gb.、Mm. Then ah、uh, enough ready. But the thing is, that is just the incoming speed. For for the incoming speed ah、uh, to reach your handphone to reach your 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 devices ah.、Uh, All these hardware devices are actually is important. 
So um, that one, we, I will share a little bit more later on now. what is the latest technology. So the other okay. things that we, that we will be covering today also uh, on these top five problems are some people say that their Wi-Fi network not stable or too many SSID and password. So what is SSID and password? I'm meaning to say mm. that when you get connected to um, your uh, uh, Wi-Fi at home, uh, they will actually mm. prompt you or oh, say, for example, it's, uh, if it's my home, Bruce. Mm. So when I go home, my SSID, I will see Bruce home. So I click on Bruce home, then I type a password, then I get mm. connected to my uh, uh, Wi-Fi. Now, but for, mm. for people who, who stay in uh, Jia Hong Chu, uh, like mm. Wilson, uh, they and have the level options. one, level two, level three, mm. level four, so, mm. so on and so forth. Uh, we start to have problems because you don't want to be like level one to have one SSID, level two have another SSID, mm. level three. So if, if like that, uh, it's a bit, uh, what we call it, J, uh, so it's uh, mm. quite cumbersome. You have to mm. keep constantly change the uh, Wi-Fi every time you go to a different place of the home. But of mm. course, that is a uh, more traditional way of uh, uh, doing things. Uh. Mm. Uh, so, um, then there's also too many, uh, so there's also internet intermittent. So, people sometimes they say, hey, sometimes my internet got internet, sometimes no internet. Mm. Uh, why are uh, Yeah, so all this why, why, why later we will be able to cover. And mm. also, some clients also want to limit the kids' usage. Oh. Uh, yeah, or, or they say, hey, after 8 p.m., I don't want them to use internet anymore. I want wow. them to go to sleep. Uh, so, all these things are uh, actually uh, can be easily resolved mm. if you know a little bit of uh, the, the home network, uh, how your router, how your uh, system works. Mm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So mm, I have a question from Aiden uh, saying that uh, having a TP-Link AX10 and an EA8100, should I buy another AX10 and enable mesh or get a repeater? Wow. Uh, Aiden, uh, later at the end, uh, we will have a Q&A session, but uh, mm. regarding your question, we'll be able to cover it shortly. So if I don't cover it, uh, thoroughly enough, uh, please uh, feel free to, to shout it out uh, during the uh, Q&A session later. Yeah. Anyway, uh, all, all our fans, right? Uh, later on, mm. every, when things are going to go off, right? I'll put uh, Bruce's uh, contact number. Lah. So you can ask him anything offline also can. No problem mm -hmm. at all. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. So um, I'm going to go through the latest technology in Wi-Fi. Because when, especially when you're moving to a new house, or you're in installing or buying or investing on a new set of gear, the, almost mm. the first thing you'll ask yourself, what is the latest and the meanest, the, the best of the best in the market? Mm. Uh, best so of the best, the, yes. Yeah, so the, the latest in the market right now uh, is uh, what, what we call the Wi-Fi 6 uh, that is uh, commercially available to uh, our home. So what is Wi-Fi 6? Wi-Fi 6 basically has uh, three things. It has a broader coverage okay so earlier on i mentioned about oh uh, if toilet no wi-fi so what what does it mean so by having uh the latest wi-fi 6 could will, will actually increase the uh, coverage it will also allow more connections so sometimes when just now when i mentioned about the top problems uh, sometimes people say hey how come my internet are uh, sometimes down it could be because your router could not handle so much traffic at the same time so with the latest Wi-Fi 6, right, it actually allows more connection, more hardware devices. Then the people say, hey, my home, not many people, like, only me, my wife, and maybe two kids or three kids. It's not a, a lot of people. What? So five people at, at home at most, why would I have a uh, uh, connection issue? Because, yeah, because a lot of, every time uh, we buy a new, new appliance, we actually introduce Wi-Fi. Like say, for example, my customer got three TV at home. All oh. the three TVs are connected via Wi-Fi. Oh, oh. Apple TV, connect via Wi-Fi. Your, mm. Each one, each everyone have a smartphone, maybe plus a laptop or plus a Apple then TV. Also the, so all these uh, are, Android TV also. Uh, all these Android TV, all these. So all these are, if, if all these devices are all connected to your Wi-Fi, uh, then uh, suddenly you realize that, wow, easily uh, 10, 20, you use it at one so, time. So I can say that uh, sometimes you like say I got five kids, uh, five kids mm. in the same time see you too. I mean say five kids all go inside the Wi-Fi. Yes, yes. So like, you must like they are carry a... that, that, that like they are carrying out a live TV. Uh, everyone got one TV on hand because now I have to see everything. Uh. Oh correct, you're right. Understand. Yeah, you're right. So uh if more people at the same time gets connected to the Wi-Fi, it might stress the network a bit. 
So uh, having a Wi-Fi 6 technology, it actually allows more connections inside. It also allows faster Wi-Fi 6 speeds. So for the from the latest uh, smart devices, uh, say for example, the latest iPhone, uh, it will support Wi-Fi 6 speed. So um, like say, for example, last time our handphone can support 3G, uh, after that 4G, after that 5G, that is, that those 3G, 4G, 5G are, are, are uh, the speed that you're referring to when you're using your uh, SIM card, okay? Hmm. But when you're at home, uh, it's something that we, the, the latest and the fastest is called the Wi-Fi 6. So your phone will, if you get a new phone, chances are it, will, it should be able to support the, support the latest Wi-Fi 6. So these are the three wow. main things uh, people look out for, uh, mm. for buy, uh, why, why they want to invest on the Wi-Fi 6, uh, the latest mm. technology. Wi-Fi okay? 6. Now, um, yeah. So Aiden, regarding your questions, uh, so this is, uh, we have uh, here two examples okay, of, a, of a Deco Mesh technology okay, and a router plus range extenders. So these are the two typical kind of uh, uh, DIY setup that people usually uh, will invest into. So the first one and the most traditional one is the router range extender. Uh, where not enough, where you will increase. So very simply, uh, say for example, uh, 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 in my master bedroom, there's not enough coverage. So I just wow. buy a range. Dude, yeah. Wow. yeah long, so I just buy a range extender. I find a power plug on the wall. I plug it onto the wall. Now, um, there is pros and cons. The pro is it is cheap and it's easy to set up. Uh, it takes just minutes to actually set up the, the range extender out of the box. Minimal network knowledge, you can get things done. But the drawback is uh, if you don't know how to set up properly and most of the time, you will actually have many, many SSID. Uh, and and it, it gets very, very cumbersome, especially when you have CCTV all this introduced into your house. Uh, when you're logged into different SSID, sometimes it might give you some limitation or red tapes. And also, uh, uh, when you're using range extender, the speed are greatly reduced. So because why? Uh, uh, half the speed uh, is being used for communication, is to let the range extender uh, to know where you are. Another half uh, of the speed is, is actually available only for you to serve your, your uh, internet. So you only have half the speed. Most of the time, this is a, of course, there is more complex uh, way to uh, uh, cal uh, calculation to calculate this, but general rule of thumb, people will just divide by two, the speed, whatever they, they got. Okay. Now, so having said that, recently they introduced a technology called the Wi-Fi mesh technology. So what does it mean? Uh, for the almost the same uh, convenience, uh, you actually can just get devices around your house and, and strategically find a power point and plug it onto the wall and you can have Wi-Fi around your home. Okay, so compare this with the traditional method. Uh, uh, this method, the mesh method uh, is uh, faster, stronger. You don't have the reduction of speed issue. You get to enjoy um, much faster speed. Uh, but of course, uh, you have to pay a little bit more premium uh, for products like this. So there are pros and there are cons. So these are, this is one of the most uh, up-to-date, most common solution people will do. Okay. Now, then the next, the next thing uh, that, we, that we probably at the later stage of our presentation, uh, we'll, show, we'll share with you why people, if got this Wi-Fi mesh, uh, why people still want to run data point in every room? Why still want to buy those wireless access points that need to connect hardwire? So all this we'll cover a little bit uh, later. Lah. Okay, so let's share about this um, uh, mesh system. Mesh, uh, rule of thumb. Some customer ask me, how many to get? The rule of thumb is always the more the better. They usually come in a package of three or, or two or, 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 or more. So... Um, having more mesh, uh, it will create a, uh, like a spider web. Uh, is when you have more mesh, uh, let's say today, uh, if you are instead of three, you have six. Uh, you have, let's say you have six mesh around your place. So having more means that you actually have uh, more ways to connect, get connected. If one of your device uh, is down over here, okay, it will automatically uh, get connected to the next one that is closest to it. 
So it's, it's something that we call the self-healing technology. Okay, so this is self-healing. And it also have an adaptive path selection, meaning to say that sometimes when you're, I got, sometimes I got customer tell me, hey, I, when I enter the home at level one, I get connected to my level one Wi-Fi. But how come uh, when I go to level two, standing right beside my wireless access point, uh, this is called wireless access point, by the way. So standing right beside my wireless access point, how come I still get one bar only? I'm just standing right to the access point. Because your level one connection, uh, when you first enter the house, is still connected. It haven't let go of you yet. So with this adaptive path selection, uh, it will actually be something like a smart uh, selection. It will, uh, it will automatically, consistently track uh, your coverage, your, your network signal. So if you are standing right to level two wireless access point, by right, you, you should drop level one wireless access point and get automatically connected to level two wireless access point. So this is what we call the adaptive path selection. Okay, so now parental control wise, you, you of, of course there are things that you can uh, differ. Okay, for our presentation, we are using uh, most, mostly TP-Link as an example. But of course, different uh, uh, products, different manufacturers, uh, they also have their own unique selling point. But if, if, you, if this is a parental control is a key feature you're looking forward to, right? Actually, um, almost all of the major brands, uh, they, they, will, they should have parental control. So look into this parental control. You should be able to have some uh, uh, more comprehensive uh, control of how you use the internet. Okay, some uh, router even allows you to limit the speed of the of the user. Okay, so why have Wi-Fi? Some people want to connect, get connected using their wireless camera. So these are some of the devices that takes up your 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 network speed, lah, You know. Okay, then the next thing would be uh, the wireless access point. Okay, wireless access point. Why Bruce, can, I, can I sorry uh, ask? But yeah. what is the common CCTV input at home that you buy from anywhere online and uh, to use data that you can collect, like record? What, what is the difference? Uh? Oh, okay. Um, CCTVs. Okay, so I just uh sidetrack a little bit uh, on yeah, CCTV. Yeah, yeah. So okay, basically there are two major types of CCTV. One is a IP camera. One is a network camera. So then they have subcategorized into uh, whether you have the storage at home or you store it in the cloud or you want to have both. Uh, all has got its pros and cons. The easiest ones are things like our Tepo 3210. So this, uh, this is actually uh, a type of CCTV that is wireless, very easy to set up. You just go in one, two, three, step one, two, three, you'll be just follow and answer positively. You'll get most of the feature that you want like uh, get to connect your CCTV, use your handphone to see what's going on, to monitor your kids, certain things. Um, but having said that, uh, this is a very simple and basic uh, CCTV. There are other more uh, complex CCTV that offers uh, different type of, different level of security. Like some customer, they say, oh, yeah, I, I post something, I, I, my CCTV is live. Like if my phone can see, uh, means that if someone hack into my my account, uh, they will be able to see, like recently there is this very famous case. Uh, they head into the account, they're able to see all the CCTV at the person's home. So some of our customers actually, uh, privacy is very important to them. Um, so like for me, if I don't wear very, if I'm not very well dressed at home, uh, like most of the time half naked at home, uh, maybe I don't, I don't really like people to hack into my system and see what my CCTV is showing. Uh. So what happened is, um, if you have such a worry, you might not want to have a CCTV that is connected to your internet. You may want to have the hard disk inside your home. So uh, inside your home means that it doesn't go out of your four walls. It won't, all the memory are stored within your home. Yeah. So there are also hybrid system, hybrid whereby you want to be uh, stored at home. Also, you want to be able to uh, see uh, your CCTV when you're outside the home. So there are, there are, there are many different types in case you're you are keen, maybe we can uh, share another. This, this is a, a, a big topic by itself. Uh, a big topic by itself. I hope I understand. I, I hope I actually shared some basic 
general information about uh, this CCTV. Thank Listen, you. go, ma. Thank you. Enough, thank you. Go, go, Thank you. Thank you. Oh, look at it. So, um, so coming back to our uh, wireless. So just now I said, hey, there's this mesh, there's this repeater. Then why still got people want to spend so much money to go and run cables to every single room and uh, connect their wireless access point hardwired? Okay, now that is uh, the reason why we want to do something like that is because we want stability. Uh, having a mesh network, you are, everything depends on wireless. Uh, if, let's say, uh, let's go back to the slide. If today you have so many walls in your house, your mesh, three, one in level one, one in level two, and one in level three. So if this is gone case, and level one uh, and level three, is the signal is not strong enough for it to get connected, uh, to do the self-healing, uh, uh, then you your whole house, uh, level two and level three, uh, there will not be internet. You only have internet on level one. So for, for bigger houses uh, and, and certain customer, they, they are where their internet is very important. Some people, they work full-time at home yeah, or, or some uh, whereby internet will really affect their lifestyle and even their business. Then uh, Hardwire it offers a much more reliable and stable solution. Not only that, in the event in the future, if any of your say for example of your wireless access point uh, is outdated say for example today is wi-fi 6 so you happily go and buy wi-fi 6 around your home and uh, get connected all to wi-fi 6 but one day uh, you've got wi-fi 7 wi-fi 8 and you want to change but you might not want to change the whole entire setup you can actually selectively just change one of it or, or any one that you any uh one that you want to upgrade or even say for example your wireless access point there's no longer up, uh, uh, there's no longer is an end of life product. That means they, they no longer put in production. So what happens? Means to say that you may not be able to buy a spare part already, because usually when the electronic appliance spoil is maybe the life cycle is around three to five years probably. So uh, if three to five years later the thing spoil, you cannot find spare part. Uh, for wireless access point that is hardwired, uh, you can actually uh, replace the unit that is faulty. You don't have to replace the whole set of uh, hardware. So what, that's one of the uh, beauty and advantages of our hardwired access point. And uh, hardwired access point also offers uh, much, more, much more selection when it comes to the type of uh, wireless access point. We have the ceiling mounted type, okay? This is the, our latest Wi-Fi 6 ceiling mounted type. Uh, this is the smaller type, non-Wi-Fi 6 type, the, but it's uh, much smaller, so it's uh, more um, uh, uh, aesthetically pleasant. So for people who say that I don't want to install it in my ceiling because I, uh, I don't want to run additional cables in my ceiling, my house uh, already come with uh, data points in the wall in every room already. I just want to add, can we have this wall type one? So you simply replace your wall plate with the wall type of uh, uh, access point, you can actually have internet access already. And it also offers you, that means uh, when you replace with this, right, it takes up one data point, but it also gives you back one hardwired point that you can install from the bottom to your PC that required a hard, cab hard cabling. That means it doesn't, maybe you don't need to use uh, Wi-Fi. Like. Okay, we also have uh, outdoor type, uh, outdoor type. Uh, maybe you want to, when you're doing uh, alfresco in your out outdoor garden, you still want to have enjoy your Wi-Fi. Yeah, these are the outdoor solutions. So wireless access point, that is they are hardwired, not using mesh. They offer more selection when it comes to a, a type of a, a access point that you want. So the last thing I'm going to go through uh, before we go into the Q&A session is the basic topology diagram of a... Uh, network home network setup okay this type of setup also there's a lot of people use it in their office as well in their small offices so uh the typical types on uh, the internet service provider maybe one tip to share for those uh home user 
that is uh, not ready to go into the, the, you know, the serious stuff, to have so many access points, so many to, to, uh, internet uh, connection is stability is not that important. They are not so fussy about it. Um, maybe during when you sign up your internet, they also give you a uh, free type of uh, Wi-Fi. Uh, basically not free, like it. They will usually package it like every month additional how much. Uh, it's like an installment plan whereby they will give you some uh, Wi-Fi mesh for you to set up at home. So usually they come in three. Then uh, internet service provider, it could be uh, Starhub, Singtel, M1, ViewQuest, uh, uh, My Republic. Uh, there's all these uh, internet service provider, we call it ISP. Then they'll be connected to your optical network terminal, your internet ser uh, service provider router, then connect to your Wi-Fi mesh. So if you have uh, more Wi-Fi mesh, then you actually can have uh, more all connected to this uh, your router, okay? Now, um, something that, is, uh, that offers more control, uh, more sophisticated um, uh, Wi-Fi network would be something like, that looks like this. So I'm going to quickly go through it, not into the details, but uh, internet service provider, then followed by your optical network terminal, your router. This optical network is, is the fiber, uh, the fiber. The, the net link trust uh, that you call people to come to your house and book appointment with them. Yeah, this is the, this, this is the one. Okay. Then after that, you have a, a, a network switch. Okay. For more professional, they want more security, more control. Uh, you can opt for a managed network switch. It's a, basically a smart switch that allows you to look into the uh, IT infrastructure of your home. Let's say certain port, they are not performing the, of the optimums or they have a... Uh, cable issue you from the network switch you'll be able to self troubleshoot some common network problems uh, this is for more of uh, advanced people to use and uh, or, or for a more professional setup so then you can also have a network switch that connects to your wireless access point on uh, please make sure that all these switches are poe because your network access point usually uh prefers to i mean that are uh, your wireless access point, usually if you have a PoE switch, it's much more easier. Like you don't have to run one more power point to your wireless access point. Just a CAT6 data cable will do, or CAT7. So then there's also the cloud controller that allows you to manage your home network. Just now Wilson was saying that if you want to be very popular at home, be the IT manager at home. So anytime your kids have got network problem, they'll call you, they'll ask you, then you can actually uh, offer them remote access to to uh solution solve their problem. That means you don't have to be at home to do my basic troubleshooting of your network. Okay, so with this, uh, I would like to uh go into our Q and A session to see if uh, anyone have any questions. Hello, hello, Vision. Hello. Ah, uh, I think I can't say anything without. Once again, thanks for blues that actually uh uh shape us so many of these kind of uh, Wi-Fi program and uh, how it's going to look like. So can I ask Bruce, right? If today mm. we are doing renovation, right? Uh, what should mm. we tell our, our electrician? What should we um, like take precaution? Okay, uh, the safest way, uh, because wireless or Wi-Fi is always uh, a guessing game. Unless mm. you have professional software to do a heat mapping, uh, to give you a to, to actually advise how many access points are re required in a home, uh, sometimes you, you, you don't really know. So the, a good practice uh, is make sure every room has the latest data cable. Mm -hmm. Like recently, I did a, a, a project in Orchard, uh, the condo. It is mm -hmm. a 10 years ago condo, uh, but uh, inside all the cable are CAT6, eh, which is still relevant today. That's good. So, uh, which is very good. Meaning to say that uh, he, he or she still gets to enjoy a lot of high-speed uh, application 
uh, devices. So mm. running the latest and most update cable also gives you more future-proof options. So if, um, now the thing is, if you... Yeah, yeah. So, uh, sorry, uh, uh, Doris mm. said I want to sleep really. Uh, a bit tired. Uh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry. Uh, I think this, this topic a bit dry. Uh. <laughs> oh, no, no, I'm not talking about you. Uh. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so what she will tell our electrician means they must put the CAT6. Uh. Okay, yeah. Uh, run CAT6 or even late, the latest one is CAT7. Uh, but uh, some electrician will curse and swear uh, if you want, to, want them to run CAT7. Uh, because, uh, CAT7. Uh, price high is one thing, but uh, it's, uh, the, the termination not so easy, uh, not so straightforward. The cable is also thicker, so meaning to say that uh, it's not easy to sneak around the cable. Like so Cat 6 is seven, thinner. So, so Cat 7 mm. is the best? Uh? Uh, not say the best. Uh, there are also shielded cable. Certain cables that are shielded so that in case you want to bury it underground or this, depending on uh, application, the most common cable to date is uh, Cat 6. Uh. Okay. Yeah, to date, yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. But if you if there's an opportunity to run Cat 7, uh, uh, of course, cost not being not an issue, go for it. Yeah, I mm -hmm. would say okay, go for Cat it. Okay, Cat 7, uh, so if, if you're doing renovation, please ask your contractor to run a Cat 7. Cat 7, very important, uh, stable mm -hmm. one. Yeah. Okay, someone asked HDB can change the data cable and add extra data point for HDB. Oh, uh, changing of cables, adding that one, uh, probably uh, a site survey would actually help to see. Site survey, okay. Yeah, change sure can change one, but it's just that is it straightforward to change it or not? So oh. some for some of the some of my customer, they say, hey, I want to change, but I don't want to see casing. I don't want to see exposed cabling. Oh, then uh, then, uh, then we have to see how how the the interior designer can come in and help you to design. If you are thinking having a thought of renovation uh, this could actually be a good time for you to talk to your designer and say that hey i want to i have this idea of having ca uh, data cables around the house so since i'm actually designing the place might as well we consume all these cables yeah but if okay, you are staying someone, in the someone asks, uh, is there hmm. a difference with flat routed uh, uh net cable oh, I'm not Sorry, uh, give me a second. Uh. Is there a difference with flat or rounded Ethernet cables? Okay, uh, cables comes in many, many fancy shapes and sizes. Uh. So uh, flat cables also got good ones and lousy ones. Round also got good and le le la lousy. But usually the rounded ones are uh, uh, what I preferred because they usually they have, uh, inside they have this plastic separator that because all the cables are cat six cables are very thin. The conductor are very thin. So sometimes if you do too much kinking, uh, the cable might break inside. So having a rounded cable with all this insulation inside, uh, for this aspect is better. Flat cable is is got its pros. Let's say for example, it's just a very short cable be between your TV and you and your maybe your network uh router. So you just want to have a very seamless cable. Flat cable offers a much aesthetic, aesthetically pleasant solution. Uh. Yeah. Hmm. Hey, that's a very well, uh, good explanation. So, yeah. okay. So, this, uh, yeah. so, what can you help our fans here? Uh, if they need your like service, do you can go to the site and uh, like yeah. take a look in their house, free survey, you know, so you can advise them yeah. what to do, what not to buy, what to buy, you know? Yeah. Do like uh, do so, this kind of survey. Mm. Correct. Uh, I think for the benefit of uh, the audiences today uh, for rest and relax fans, we uh, will offer an island-wide uh, uh, yeah. solution to actually uh, go to your place. If you have any networking problems, you can uh, share with us, make an appointment with us, uh, give us a call at this number. Uh, then uh, Yeah, correct. For Bruce Lee, Bruce Lee. Yeah, uh, nah, actually... <laughs> A lot of my colleagues can also help, not just boost the... <laughs> yeah, so anyone who picks up the phone, just let them know uh, that you are rest and relax fans uh, and uh, you, you would like to have a free site survey. We will no offer. application, uh, free one, uh, no application. Yeah, uh. yes, yes, don't worry. <laughs> I yeah. think it's good, like, you see, uh, like, always like I drive car, huh? sometimes I drive car, mm. right? Uh, I always think if I met an accident, what should I do? 
uh, should call an uh, insurance party, but I don't know who is my insurance. Sometimes I even buy, I don't know which company or who to look for. I think it's good that when your house got meet any problem about this type of like um online stuff, right? Can always look for AOE lah. Yeah, I think at least someone helping you jaga to do. Like for my house, right? Everything I throw to him on. Uh, my internet got problem. This one got even my bill got problem. Also, I I look for him. Like sometimes I the the tackle you know, uh, bill me something, like I don't understand. Yeah. That I will ask him hey, what is this what is that. Yeah. Then, then Bruce very good. Or advise me what to do, what to do, you know. Yeah, I think it's good mm. that uh, it's like an insurance idea like uh, when you, uh, uh, you know, at least if you say a house with any problem, right, you have someone to look for. Like. I say Bruce will be the like the online Wi-Fi doctor like mm. that. Like. Agree, agree. <laughs> at least something yeah. you have some way to ask, right? Yeah. Mm, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay mm. that's good. So thanks for all the uh, sharing today, Bruce. All right. Uh, we have thank actually... You, uh, you know, uh, yeah, end our this uh, sharing section. And very thanks a lot that we still have, wow, 26 fans and never give up on us, man. Give you a crap. Uh. <laughs> thank you, man. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, thanks a lot. Uh, we are trying to give more topic and uh, uh, nice content to share with everyone. Not mm. always renovation, this and that, but I think a lot of sharing will be good. Okay? Thank All right, you. so thank you, man. thanks for everyone and thanks for Bruce also. <laughs> So if you think that this uh, sharing help everyone, right? Can you type a eight? Type a eight. If you think this sharing is helpful, please help me to type a eight and one more share out to all your friends. Can all right before we end our talk east, talk west, talk rest and relax. Can can help me to uh press a eight to thanks our uh, guest uh, Bruce Lee for his sharing today. Oh, okay, okay. Someone have said it already. Thank you so much. Thank you, Yvonne. Thank you, Ethan. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, thank you, Kat, uh, Cynthia. CC, thank you. Uh, Perla, thank you. Thank you. Uh, Shepherd, thank you. Thank you. Next week topic. Ha, okay, let's vote. Let's vote. Uh, next week topic, want to talk what? Talk is. Talk West, talk rest and relax. Okay, so hey, thank you, Sharin. Yvonne, thank you. So hey, can can you help me? Know what topic you all write a, a few lah like, that I choose? Can what topic to talk? Anything? Yeah, anything. Anything can without uh nothing related with renovation also can. All right, you want to talk about life also can. <laughs> now lockdown ma, so just talk lah. Like, everyday talk lah. Like. How my 22 fans, what you want to stop the topic, can just write down, comment, yeah. Want to talk what? Then I go and, I go and uh, look for the topic and get those uh, professionals come in. Smart home. Okay, smart home. Good. Uh, Jenny, please write down smart home. Okay. Any more topic rather than smart home? Anything that uh, can put any value or save money mm. or thing that can buy from Papa or cannot buy from Papa or anything online. Yeah. Toilet detail. <laughs> okay, Shepherd, interesting. Uh, toilet detail means what? Uh? The WC. Uh? Like what type of uh, a toilet, toilet, toilet bowl to use? Uh? Or, or, or tiles? Or, or like uh, design. Like what? The toilet here, like what? And nowadays, uh, the toilet uh, can like uh, got the Chui Fong Tong, you know? You sit down there, uh, then got wind. Or towels, uh, okay, okay. Toilet towels, okay, you can. What type of toilet towels? Uh? Okay, uh, maybe those like. Uh, not waterproof lah, maybe it's like a water resistant type. Mm. Show more three room video, okay. Three room design lah, okay. I can share lah, maybe I get one designer to share about three room design, or what is open concept, or what to do, you know. Okay, Doris can, three room video. I think this one okay lah. We can show you the design, the concept, how we hack the wall, you know, uh, do nice kitchen, open concept, right? 
So we got smart home, sound choice, the three bedroom, three room video sharing. No problem, Doris. Welcome. How to share water pipe after 10 years? <laughs> okay, Jessica, your water pipe is a HDB or condo. Because condo, you need to hack the wall. HDB easy, right? You just change the you know, whatever pipe. So uh, I must know whether it's a condo or HDB. But pipe don't need to change even after 10 years, right? unless it's leakage. Right? Leakage, then you need to change. Right? But no leakage, don't need, ma. Right? No leakage, don't need, ma. Unless you got a uh, heavy leakage or what. If not, it's quite okay. All right. So, yeah. Any more topic? Okay, I think this few topic will be good. Huh? So I will actually choose uh, one and get the professional to come in to share with everyone. Okay. All right. So once again, thank you very much. Thanks for my 18 fans now still with me in the Facebook. <laughs> thank you very much. So again, stop east, stop west, stop rest and relax. Okay. See you guys. Thank you. See you again. Stay safe. Huh? Bye.